is a new day here in Seoul and I apologize about the noise. I'm right outside the subway station and there's like a road in front of me so it's kind of noisy but um, I've come to the Guaja area. It's kind of like nearby Hongdae, a little bit further up. I'm meeting Alex, we're gonna go cafe hopping. Um, I don't know how many cafes we're gonna go to. We have one we wanted to check out and then there's another one we might also go to. We thought we'd just like explore the area. We're not really sure what else is around here though to be honest but I thought I'd take you guys along with me regardless. So yeah, I'm just gonna wait out here for Alex now and then I'll see you guys once we get to the cafe. This is the cafe. It is so cute, but very tiny. Essentially, it's just like the window seat, the way you order. There's like these little takeout nooks here. And then in this room is where you sit. This is what we ended up getting. I ended up getting an Earl Grey pound. Alex decided to venture out and get a Espiana, I believe it's called. It looks super good. And then I got this ice cream latte or chocolate latte. But yeah, we're gonna enjoy our coffee now. It was really nice. The owner was super kind, very chatty, but we ended up leaving early because these people came in and they were just like coughing and stuff and with the whole corona thing we were like nope we're getting out of here. We're gonna go walk around this neighborhood for a bit though and probably go and check out another cafe so I'll keep you guys updated. Hi, hey baby. Nope, okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Backing away, backing away. Passing by, thanks. Oh, you guys should definitely check it out if you were in the area because if you watched my last vlog, it was really good. getting some more drinks. This time I got a lemonade while Alex got an Americano. But check out the floor. How crazy is this? It's just like a hill. Just finished at the second cafe now. It started like getting busy. I think all these people are on their break at work right now, so they all came in. So we decided to go to get lunch instead. There's this place called Little Forest that I've seen on Instagram. I wanted to check out, and Alex is down, so we're gonna head over there now. I'll see you once I get there. Lunch is served and how good this area thing looks. So firstly, we got this shrimp avocado toast. It looks amazing. And then we got this chicken pesto sandwich. It comes with a little salad on the side. But yeah, I'm super excited. It looks so delicious. for lunch now it was really good definitely recommend checking out little forest if you are in the Hongdae area the only thing is it's very tiny there are like three tables two of them like two seaters and one like bigger table but 
I would say on the weekend it probably gets busy, so definitely go early. Luckily we came on a weekday and it's empty and the area is pretty dead right now. But yeah, definitely check it out if you're looking for a really nice, like healthy kind of brunch in Hongdae. I had a really good time with Alex but after lunch we ended up going our separate ways because the weather has gone a lot more gloomier. I think there might be another typhoon coming I'm not really sure but yeah it's just gloomy so we were like let's go home. Anyway when I got home though I wanted to update you guys because I got a message from my school. I'm not going to be working for another week. If you guys aren't aware because of the corona situation in Korea right now a lot of schools and a lot of like regulations have changed so with hogwans they were told to go online if you weren't going online i guess you had time off like me so the past two weeks i haven't been in work or haven't been doing anything because yeah of the um going into level 2.5 but i was expecting to go back yeah next week but that's not happening now so on one hand i'm a little like happy because i have more time off but on the other hand i'm a little sad because i don't get paid for having this time off because i am only a part-time employee so i don't get any of those benefits so it's kind of sad but if you guys have any like recommendations on places for me to visit why i have more time off please let me know because like the past like few weeks i've just been like in bed essentially on netflix and on webtoons which by the way i want to ask you guys Give me some recommendations for webtoons because I feel like I've read so many. I'm gonna like insert like a screen cap of the ones I'm currently reading. Like these are my favorite ones, but I need more. So give me some recommendations, please. Because yeah, another week off. I don't know what exactly I'm gonna be doing to be honest. Um, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you did, please like and subscribe to my channel. I will see you all in the next one.